Hi everybody and welcome back to another Project Cars 2 update video here on this channel. Now the Ferrari Essentials DLC has just been released and it comes with 8 new vehicles and 2 tracks and we're going to be checking it out in this video. Plus if you want to check out the patch notes for the update 7.00 they're all in the description it was only a small patch. Right the first car we're going to be checking out in this DLC is the Ferrari 250 GT Berlinetta. Now this is a classic from 1961 it's capable of 168 miles per hour not to 100 in 5.5 seconds and it is and it has 260 horsepower quite a nice classic and i'll definitely be testing out i love classic cars i'd love to have a car like this sitting in the garage but i guarantee you the price tag on this thing is probably crazy right we're going to run through all the cars like this look at all the stats and what they look like and then we're going to be testing one out on one of the new circuits let's get straight to the second car of this dlc Right guys, next up in this DLC pack is the Ferrari 250 Testarossa. Now this has a top speed of 162, 0 to 100 in 5.3 and has slightly more horsepower than the last car of 290. Now this is an open top car and again another real classic, another one to test out. And one thing I do like about Project Cars, they do have a big selection of classic vehicles. So we're going to definitely be testing this one out at some point. Right, let's move on to the next car in this DLC. I'll see. Right guys, next up is the Ferrari 458 Special A. Now this is a Road B vehicle, 202 miles per hour top speed, a 0 to 103 seconds and a 605 horsepower. Wow, super powerful, probably really difficult to handle, but it looks absolutely amazing. And that's one thing I do like about the look of this car. Right, let's move on to the next one in this DLC. Right guys, next up is a Group 4 car, the Ferrari 512 BBLM, 199 top speed, 0 to 100 in 4.4 seconds, has 475 horsepower. Now again, this car is going to be very difficult to control and look at the size of the engine on this absolute beast. Now I do like this group, so this is definitely going to be a car that I'll be testing out and I do like using the shifter on these vehicles as well. So hopefully this one will be good. I do like the addition that they've added. Right, let's move on to the next car in this awesome pack. Right guys, next up is another road vehicle and this is the Ferrari F12 TDF. Now this has a crazy top speed of 211, 0 to 100 in 2.9 seconds and has a crazy 780 horsepower. What a road car, this is an absolute rocket. Oh god, I wouldn't even guess on the price on this, but I bet you it's a lot of money. Right guys, next up is the Ferrari F355 Challenge. Now this is definitely going to be a car I'm going to enjoy racing. Top speed of 187, 0 to 100 in 4.6 seconds, 375 brake horsepower. Now I don't think this one's going to be that much of a challenge to race because it has a little bit less power and probably has decent handling. So I'm definitely going to be trying this one out. So I'll be looking forward to this one. Right, let's move on to the next car in this DLC. Right guys, next up is a real classic. It's the Ferrari F40, 202 top speed, 0 to 100 in 3.7 seconds, 480 brake horsepower. Now I've tried out this car on many games and every game I've tested it out, it's been really, really good fun. So I'm really looking forward to this one. But we are leading to a car which is gonna be absolutely crazy and one to test out today. So we're getting to that very soon. And as you probably guess, it's the Ferrari XXK from 2015, 217 miles per hour top speed, 0 to 102.5, and has a crazy 1,050 horsepower. Wow! Now, one of the first games I test this out on a steering wheel was Drive Club, and even on that game, it was absolutely crazy fast, really difficult to control. But I'm going to be testing it out. But first up, we're going to check, check, check out the two circuits they've added on this DLC. So let's get straight into that right now, guys. Right, guys, first up is Mugello GP. Now, this is one of my favourite circuits. If you've seen any of my videos on a set of course, I absolutely love this. 
And plus on the MotoGP games, you also get a short version of Mugello as well. Now the other circuit they've added, I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that, but it's a test track for Ferrari in Italy. So I'm definitely gonna be testing that out right now. And you know what vehicle I'm gonna test out. Like I've just said a moment ago, it's the crazy beast. So let's get straight into testing it out. Right, so here we go in the Ferrari FXXK. This is a crazy car to test out. I don't know this test circuit either, so I'm just going to do a sighting lap, and then I will show you the replay. Now, this is only going to be a short video, guys. I'm using the uh, Logitech G29 for this as well. Let's see what it's like. It sounds beautiful. It looks beautiful. The cockpit on this car is just unbelievable. Now, I've got it on authentic settings, so I'm going to have to be careful. Just trying to look at the map, which way this circuit goes. We've got to be careful. Uh, I'm not sure whether this circuit's going to be perfect for this car with the amount of power it has. But I do like the test circuits they've added on this game. The Porsche one was pretty good fun. So hopefully this one will be a good one to race around. Right, we've got a sharp turn coming up. Let's slow it down. Try and get on the kerbs and accelerate. Oh, this car is... It just sounds brilliant. I'm not sure whether it sounds better than it does on a set of Corsa. But not many games beat a set of Corsa for the sound. Uh, and the handling, I'm afraid, but uh, Project Cars 2 is trying its hardest to bring out some awesome cars on the game. And the DLC cars they have delivered haven't been that bad. Right, got another difficult corner. Slow it down and slowly feed the power on again. Oh, it's so good to be back on a steering wheel. And it's been, I've been out for so long. And is that the end? Or did it need to slow down? That is the end. So that is one lap. So there you go, guys. That is the test circuit. We're definitely going to be doing some races around Mugello uh, very, very soon. I'm going to leave you a replay of that lap. Just have a look. Have a look at, uh, listen to the sounds. See what you think. Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to check out the patch notes. They're all in the, the description. And thank you so much for watching. And I will see you very, very soon.